This is a demonstration of the Boxer Bicycles custom integrated chain wrist. This piece here allows you to remove the rear wheel without handling the chain, getting grease all over your hands, keeps you and the bike cleaner, and it's a, just a real simple system that doesn't take a lot of special technique to work. So, you're riding along and you happen to get yourself a nice flat tire in the rear, so bummer, but you got to change the flat, right? Finish your ride, shift down to the very last cog there, and now you're on the chain rest. Stop the wheel, and you'll note that the wheel, of course, is spinning independent of the chain and the freewheel. Freewheel is free to spin the other direction because it's not, the chain is not on the cassette, it's on the chain rest. So, remove your rear brake. And remove the rear wheel like you would on a standard bicycle. Undo your quick release, pull the derailleur out of the way, and drop the wheel out of the frame. Go ahead and fix your flat tire. And you'll note that the chain is resting on the chain rest. Um, it is free to move. Um, there's no real reason to do that other than when you're remounting the wheel in the frame and you want to get the chain off the chain rest back onto the cassette. So that is a stainless ring and it doesn't have any powder coat or paint finish on it so that's protected. It won't corrode as the chain rubs on it. So now that you've fixed your flat, it's time to replace the rear wheel. And it, it goes back into the frame very much like any other standard bicycle. Just pull the rear derailleur out of the way, line up the wheel on the fenders, and turn it back into the dropouts. Close the quick release. Close your rear brake. Again, most important. Don't want to forget that part snap. It's all clear of the rim. So to get going again, you have to get the rear wheel spinning. You can do that any number of Lift up the rear wheel by the saddle and get it spinning with your hand like I just did. Or you can mount it cyclocross style running alongside and throw in a leg over and let the wheel coast while you're not turning the cranks. Um, to get it rolling, to get that chain up off the chain rest and back into the cassette. What you have to do is get that wheel rolling and shift up off the top and give it a little crank, real gentle. And there you go, you're back in. Back in business. So again, that's the Boxer Bicycle Custom Integrated Chain Rest. It is an option that's available on all Boxer Bicycles. It does require some slightly um, specialized equipment, but it's all Shimano standard equipment, or you can do it with a freewheel system that doesn't use a cassette. Um, just requires a little extra space on the very end here for this chain rest, and um, it's good to go.